Hello there, good people. What's going on? Good morning from Dhaka, Bangladesh. Let me quickly do the last video for the night. I already have done the two. One I have done from the Casio shop where I went last night to buy my new watch. This was something I really, really wanted. Forgot the exact serial number. I'll write it down if you want me to. But this is one of those dials that I really wanted. Um, very difficult angle. Okay. So I got this yesterday alongside I showed in previous video. This beautiful other dial. I never had anything of this color from Casio. Both are Casios and high-end Casios, really beautiful. So I did a video from the Casio shop, the first shop in Bangladesh, which started the official, uh, you know, Casio or watch business in Bangladesh, right, before 70s. So I hope you'll enjoy it, even though it was noisy, I didn't have my mic, but I really had good time. You can see some great watches. I'll leave a link below of the website you can buy if you're in Bangladesh. So I have about seven fragrances here today as it's summer. Someone always like you know i always get requests to do budget fragrances like they are up class designer niche they're middle budget mid budget and also there are something like you can say pretty much within 35 dollars these are good fragrances some of these are way cheaper than 35 okay so let's go first fragrance i want to show you uh, mind you this is an ugly bottle but it's a good fragrance this is arm of tag him uh, you can see from the look of the bottle it's nothing that you want in your collection even by any, any even if people give it for free i mean with the magnetic kind of magnetic cap i mean this does look like i don't know what does it look like it looks like a worse like not worse the parts that you find in mm, like minus this part let me tell you this looks like one of those parts we could find as a student in a store where they're having like touring it you know <laughs> like <laughs> what is touring it like a five dollar a wallet you know it looks like that and it looks very cheap very tacky i understand that many of the arm of hunter bottles also are very ugly but i had this before i sold it off uh, the reason i got it one more day was that this smells a lot like blood chanel and this is one of the first blood chanel clones and i have massive respect for it it has very good longevity on the shirt skin mm, up for debate on the shirt it lasts long time the best part is this one can be still had for 25 dollars i think last time i saw and for that price 100 mil is not a bad proposition at all so one day i was in a shopping mall and it was somewhere in 2018 you know so i was looking at you know looking for i think arm of shades or shades wood something like that and i saw this one body spray one day you know i'm like let me try it again and i sprayed it and i really really liked it, it was very fresh and it was less alcohol for some reason from the body spray then i decided to get the perfume and uh, the opening is a little bit alcoholy uh, it, it let it go for a while like five minutes it becomes a beautiful blood chanel inspired fragrance you can get this one of the cheapest blood chanel uh, dupes available some of these are dupes some of them are not second one i'm going to show you is a fragrance that is not endless in fragrantic and i think i was on the first one <laughs> to review this <laughs> i got some dust on it this is a uh, house of frank olivier passion man intense so you know uh all the passion man or passion man passion for him or something like that they have one more you know and they have like two or three from this line this one uh, tends to smell a lot like platinum egoist by chanel i did review this check it out uh chanel's platinum egoist is way better quality i have it on my hand yeah so chanel's quality is so much more polished the rosemary the the metallic notes some florals uh, that one is the highest standard if I want to compare this to, I would say something like between Fierce and like Namigo is, you know, very good quality. Longevity is not the best. Okay. I got like three and a half hours from it, but for the price that you get this for 75 mil, check out the price. Very, very cheap. Okay. So Ode de Passion Man, uh, Intense by Frank Olivier. Great alternative to Fierce, Mont Blanc Legend and like Namigo is good fragrance for summer. <clears throat> Next one, it's, I think not $35. If you find uh, perhaps 50 ml that will be under 30 dollars that's how i put it in the list but these are more like 45 bucks still you can get a big bottle like 150 ml like this lacoste lom after a long time i'm showing this i have 150 ml and it's one of my older bottles such a fantastic fragrance nobody talks about it nobody when it came out yeah some reviewers talked about it but hype is gone so that's where this one is still a champ because this one smells great it has mandarin uh tangerine oranges is very orangey and then it has a quince and also rhubarb and these notes you don't see every day in designer fragrance or any other fragrance for that matter uh, such a great all man kind of like done in a classy way it's a very laid-back style 
it's not really bright it's not really bitter almond like pegasus but it has feel like it has a creaminess on the skin which i really like i like sake all and this one the same if you like sake all you would like this lacoste lom you can try the limitless also the intense both are great but this is my favorite because you can see the juice color orange the last four next one the forgotten gem uh, do you miss old jeremy i indeed do and my game started with some of these channels one of them was jeremy and i absolutely supported him 100 uh, percent back in the days nowadays it's not like i don't support him or anything but uh, his trend of what he's doing right now is just not my uh, cup of tea but anyway i remember when he introduced us with this beautiful bottle which i don't want to talk about but i did review this from genting highlands in malaysia perial is 360 degree red yeah many people forgot about it like nautica voyage this one they are getting a little bit aged right now you know so they're already old in the market people know cool water this one so uh price is still great very is 360 red you can get 200 ml like this for i think under 40 45 bucks and that is a great value you can get per 100 ml like 20 dollars so in usa these are sold for 15 20 bucks in tj max great great cheapy so you guys know uh this is aqua digio with more pepper with so much more presence synthetic it doesn't smell great from close but in the air it smells great these are jeremy's words not mine and i did get many compliments wearing this like my friends normally guys this is not a girl's uh favorite uh, aqua digio for some reason the dna women don't like um they think like it smells like father figure uncles a little bit aged and i i like that it's okay it's respect but this is really really a good fragrance for staple for summer you can still get this great great service great service like 212 men nyc it has great service you know it lasts like at least seven eight hours still just go heavy on the shirt and spray on the shirt like half an hour before you leave this one will project higher the heat better the projection one of the best aqua dg alternatives and i really like the way this smells and the price tag and the color of the bottle the last three uh, let me show you this used to be i think <clears throat> under 40 dollars now the prices are going high a little bit of 45 but if you buy a tester maybe you can get those 40 dollars mark which is called bentley for men black edition so this is a bit odd one this one doesn't get much mention bentley for men intense and i think the silver lake which is also kind of like aqua digio more floral i think this one the black edition is really really nice it has some spices it has some pepper it has some violet leaves and i think this fragrance smells fresh fruity dark and a little bit spicy at all at the same time okay you can wear this all year round you know when you smell this it smells familiar but you cannot tell like if they copied something yeah when i smell this it does not remind me of many fragrances that i own but it definitely can be worn in colder months too but this one has good presence if you like violet leaves you can give it a try it does have a cooling sensation with the pepper kind of like a cooling pepper you know you can try that Bentley for men black edition good fragrance a little bit more presence last two uh the second one is a little bit different it's not a freshy this is a sweet perfume but can be worn in summer i tested it trust me it works latafa jasur that's the name very beautiful bottle i think they took inspiration or drew inspiration from 212 uh, nyc like 212 vip sorry 212 men vip and it's a great bottle i really like the way the bottle looks very affordable 20 something bucks this one is made to smell like pakuraban phantom uh kind of like pakuraban phantom on most part and a little bit of a scandal purum by karina herrera uh, what's so good about that the dna the sweetness it draws attention really good performance you guys know latafa lasts a long time if you want to wear sweet fragrance it has some citruses up top which makes it wearable but on most part on the dry down you'll get sweetness okay so it is more sweet than fresh but i wear this in summer it smells good it's not cloyingly or annoyingly sweet it's just this nice sweetness uh, pushes for a good long time uh, let's say you are interested in a girl in university if you talk to her if you are wearing a nice perfume with your duo and you know nice little clothing nice watches nice shoe uh, this is a good pair you know i mean like good fragrance to make good impression okay it smells very very up class that's the number two number one uh, to my surprise this fragrance grew on me a lot i did not think much of it at first i mean i liked it it's sort of aventus like but i found this is more than aventus this is kind of like aventus meets hachivat and you guys some of you know already i reviewed this recent times this is arm of ego tigre 
this version the very tacky bottle very tacky like uh the zippo lighter kind of a thing and got this cheap uh that fake leather suede thing with the tiger on it looks cool i like the tiger and tiger is sort of like our national animal we can find them in sander ones so uh this fragrance when i got it at first you know i did not think this was going to do much for me like i did say it's a good fragrance but uh, if you already have too many aventus clones like cd name this and that you don't need it uh yes i still say that but check this on the dry down this starts smelling a lot like hachivat and that's just to my nose especially on the clothes when i spray it it's very beast mode it's eight hours plus uh and from that you know sometimes i get choked so i tend to spray less with this now previously i used to go like five to six now i go three so i would like to say one other thing some of the reviewers are just having a good time you know no names no hatred but uh some of them are just like going 30 sprays 40 sprays that is not cool that is not fun i mean you do that and you see people's reaction this is literally harassment okay and you don't need that many sprays do not no, no need to waste you know you don't need that many sprays for sure you can go like 15 20 with a versace puro my understand menu fresh those are good but imagine someone's spraying like uh i don't know uh, nishane or kalan pdm kalan why i mean you don't need to so those are just to uh, get views and those are just to get people to laugh and they go oh, that's cool um not cool okay and uh, none of this fragrance i would suggest go for this sprays. okay that is just uh, not cool anyway so back to arm of ego you need three sprays with this and just go out go out in the sun go out in the humidity see the performance it continues to project when you come back home and hang the shirt next morning you can smell it so hachivat meets aventus sort of like a pineapple uh, fruity woody and very uh, strong beast mode like the tiger performance okay thank you so much for watching hopefully you enjoyed it do let me know uh, if you tried these and what are your favorites i'll see you soon i think i'll sign out for the night take care bye bye